Hello, I'm Marion Dane Bauer, and I'm here to read my newest picture book, The Animals Speak, A Christmas Eve Legend, illustrated by Brittany Bogus and published by Beaming Books. Long and long, the story has been told of a young woman, her husband, a donkey, the faithful donkey, carrying them to their ancestral land. Long and long the story has been of shepherds, angels, sheep, the woolly sheep grazing in the fields. Long and long the story of a star, magi, camels, the swaying camels bearing gold and frankincense and myrrh. Angels carried the news to shepherds and they came a star beckoned the magi, and they came. No one called the animals, but they came too. Long and long, stable, manger, and the cows, the gentle cows. All stood in silent awe until the animals found words to praise. The donkey, the faithful donkey, the sheep, the woolly sheep, the camels, the swaying camels, and the gentle cows. Long and long and long, the child. Now and now the story is told of a young woman, her husband, a donkey, of shepherds, angels, sheep. Now and now the story of a star, magi, camels, of a stable manger cows. Now we gather to celebrate the child. Our story told, we go to our beds to await the stroke of midnight, the velvet stroke of midnight, when once more the animals speak. Donkeys waking in stables, sheep grazing in pastures, camels plodding across deserts, cows resting in barns, elephants gathered on savannas, bears stirring in dens, penguins cozied in snow, whales swimming in the sea. All lift their heads to the starry sky and cry, rejoice. Forever and forever, the story shall be sung in treetops whispered in woods, bayed in yards, purred on pillows, and repeated in home after home after home by every one of God's creatures. The child is here. Rejoice. A note about the legend. The legend of animals talking on Christmas Eve probably grew out of another often told tale. In that one, Jesus was said to have been born just as Christmas Eve turned into Christmas Day. Magical midnight occurrences gathered around that idea. The most lasting one was of animals being given the power of speech. The animal stories take different forms. The ox and the donkey are said to bow their heads at the stroke of midnight. Swarming bees hum a Christmas carol. One tale tells of the deer in the forest falling to their knees to honor the Great Spirit. In one version, when the animals in the stable were given words, they quarreled. By the time they understood what they had witnessed, dawn had robbed them of the power of speech and they could no longer praise. Every one of these stories honors the birth of the Christ child.